Folks, we got some news out of Michigan, and this could be very significant from the Detroit. Well, actually, we'll go to Jenna Ellis first. Breaking this evening, the County Board of Canvassers in Wayne County, Michigan, refused to certify the election results. If the state board follows suit, the Republican state legislator will select the electors. Huge win for Donald Trump. Very, very interesting. Uh, they found major problems with Let's see here. Absentee voting precincts didn't match the number of ballots cast. The imbalances between August and November are not an exact comparison. But look, there's a lot here. And uh, we've got the perfect person, Sidney Powell, standing by, member of President Trump's legal team. Uh, Sidney, welcome. And I know you've been handling a lot of the Georgia situation and Dominion, but your reaction to the situation in Michigan, please. Well, that's an excellent development, and I would expect the entire Michigan board to reject the, the counts from the ballots. The, the election could not have been more rigged than it was, and I think it also affected the race of uh, Senator John James. The same patterns fall there. We're still doing statistical analysis of that race, but this, the math just doesn't add up for anything, and we know Dominion has a long history of rigging elections. That's what it was created to do to begin with. We've introduced the affidavit of the person who worked with Maduro, a high-ranking military officer who saw it all happen and explained how it worked. And it's it's out for the public to see on my Twitter feed at Sydney Powell number one. So don't tell me there's no evidence of fraud. We've got increasingly mounting evidence of significant fraud across multiple states that casts into question the validity of the election.